Travis Barker is one of the most public celebrities in Hollywood. He's admitted to cheating literally hundreds of times, among a ton of other scandalous things. But not everyone knows that this entire time, he's secretly been raising another daughter. And the story of everything that happened is truly insane. Travis has never shied away from the cameras, he's had absolutely nothing to hide, and he's proven it by writing an autobiography of himself and going on reality TV with his entire family, twice. His first family reality show, Meet the Barkers, was quite popular back in 2005 when it began airing. It featured his ex-wife, Shanna Mokler, and his two children. Children, Landon and Alabama. Mama wants some. <gasps> but there was an extra person who no one seemed to pay as much attention to, and that's Shannon's daughter, Atiana De La Hoya, who was featured in the show a number of times. Back then, most people didn't make much of her appearance. Everyone assumed that she was just visiting her mother or staying in the same home of the Barkers while the show was being filmed. But it turns out there was more going on that we didn't know of. In fact, it's safe to say that Atiana is more of Travis's daughter than her biological father. Apparently, Travis raised her like she was his actual daughter, and it's pretty surprising because with how open Travis is, not a lot of people seem to know about this. He and Atiana have apparently been close throughout the years, and she has always been featured in anything concerning the family of the Barkers. Currently, she lives with them and also often appears in family photos and at family events like Travis's recent wedding to Kourtney Kardashian. Atiana was a bridesmaid at Kourtney's wedding to Travis, and that definitely proves just how close they are. On the other hand, there are very few pictures of her with her real father, the boxing champion Oscar De La Hoya, and she spoke about this in her interview with Us Weekly magazine. She revealed that the world knew him better than her because they watched his career. But for her, her knowledge of him wasn't from their relationship itself, but from people who told her about who he was. My idea of him wasn't necessarily from our relationship, but it was more from who I was told he was. She also said that she saw her dad as infrequently as once a year, and that she didn't even know whether to call him dad. She wasn't exaggerating about it all, and Oscar admitted it himself in his own interview with the Allison Interviews podcast. It's the one thing I regret the most. He said that he actually ran away from Atiana because he had been scared of raising her. This occurred after he had tried to be a full-time father to her for a few years during his engagement to her mother in 1998. Unfortunately, it didn't didn't last because two years later they had the messiest breakup ever due to some cheating allegations surrounding Oscar. And when that happened, he backed out of his role as a father. Travis came into the picture four years later when he got married to Atiana's mom, Shanna, and that's when he became her stepfather. But he did more than just that. He actually stepped up to become her father figure since her dad was only occasionally around her. I only see him every so often maybe like once a year. Travis himself hasn't openly admitted to it, but Oscar has shared his respect for Travis and his regrets about not taking on his role. He first admitted that about two years back on an Instagram Q&A when a follower asked him how he felt about Travis claiming he raised his daughter, and his reply was absolutely shocking. He shared that he had nothing but respect for Travis for taking on his role with Atiana, and this was really not what his followers were expecting to hear because you would think this would have caused some serious family drama. But they were even more shocked that Atiana's relationship with Travis is so good that her father acknowledged it on Instagram, but it was heartwarming because it turned out Shanna wasn't really in the picture as well for Atiana. Apparently, Atiana and Shanna's relationship has always been strained, and things took a turn for the worse when Travis got married to Kourtney Kardashian recently. And the reason behind it is absolutely crazy. It was heartbreaking. I, you know, I mean, it's every mother's worst nightmare. It came out that Shanna believes the reason for their divorce was a result of Travis's alleged cheating with Kim Kardashian, Kourtney's sister. My family's broken because of this family, and now my kids and I are alienated from each other because of another sister in the family. According to her, Travis had had an affair with Paris Hilton previously at some point, and because Paris and Kim were so close, he sort of also drifted towards Kim. Shanna stated that back at the time, she and Travis were trying to work on his infidelity issue in their marriage, but he went ahead to hire Kim as a model for his clothing brand, Famous Stars and Straps. So she then ended things by commenting on their relationship and calling it weird because all of that had happened in the past. Tragically, these allegations seem to put an even deeper strain on the already strained relationship between Atiana and her mom. Travis and Kim later came out to deny these allegations and Shanna didn't put up a fight. And that made everyone wonder why she would say that if it wasn't the truth. Eventually, things calmed down, but when Shanna started telling some weird stories again, she 
revealed that she felt concerned that Travis and Courtney's actions were alienating her children from her, and everyone wondered what she meant by that. But it didn't take long to find out. Thanks for uh, destroying my family. Twice. Just months after she made the statement, her children, Alabama and Landon, revealed that Shanna had never completely been a part of their lives and that they supported their father's relationship with Courtney. This was not all that surprising, but it added up to why Shanna was scared of her children alienating her. However, Shanna denied having any problems whatsoever with the kids. In an interview, she said that she thought Alabama and Landon's Instagram posts about her were just mere signs of rebellion. But in less than a month, she changed her tune. This time around, in an interview with Page Six the following month, Shanna revealed that she was actually not on speaking terms with her two teenage kids at all. She told Page Six that she was trying to give all of her kids some space so they could heal. And after sharing all this, she proceeded to expand further and she began talking about healing from the past. Of course, everyone wondered what this past was and whether or not Atiana was involved. After analyzing the situation, it definitely seemed that who Shanna was referring to might have been Atiana who shows little to no affection for Shanna publicly. Atiana, on the other hand, has maintained a close relationship with her stepdad Travis as well as Courtney, her stepmom. Before Courtney's wedding to Travis, Atiana was often spotted with her on trips and holidays as well as on her birthday. Courtney made sure to let Atiana know of her love for her, then by reposting a selfie of them on her Instagram and adding the sweetest caption ever that read, sweetest in the land. Her stepdad Travis also did the same and posted a picture of them on his Instagram and captioned it with his love to Atiana. Her step siblings also seem to be getting along very well with her. Back in December 2021, Courtney shared a heartwarming photo on Instagram of Atiana posing with Alabama, and shortly after that, she posted a whole family photo of them with Landon, Travis, and her daughter Penelope together during the holidays. In total, Atiana has about seven step siblings, but her relationship with her other step siblings from her father, Oscar, like Lauren and Victoria, remains a secret. But from what I've seen so far, it seems Travis' secret daughter is more of a Barker than a De La Hoya. Luckily, it appears that this works out well for everyone involved. Travis and his children appear to be on extremely good terms with Atiana. But what do you think? Is Atiana and Travis' relationship really strong, or is the bar low because of what happened with Oscar De La Hoya. And do you think Shanna was right about Atiana being alienated from her by Travis and Courtney? Let me know what you think in the comments below.